How to insert a table in Slack. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I'll show you what we can and cannot do when it comes to tables with Slack. So let's just go ahead and dissect this and get started. So you will have your channels here, obviously, and you will have the messages tab. Unfortunately, I'm just going to let you know right away that there is no possible way yet for you to insert a table in the messages. Now, there used to be a method where we could use an application that allowed us uh, or allows us to actually insert some tables using CSV files, but that website is no longer working. At least I just tried it right now and it just did not work, which was uh, slacktables.com, where you can see we used to be able to uh, basically, let me just go ahead and open up from Google, upload a CSV file uh, and then .com. And then it's just going to create a table for us and we can just go ahead and upload it from Slack here in the messages. But this is no longer available in the apps. And I, I tried to find another app which could uh, replace it, but uh, I, just, I just couldn't find any. So the only possible way for you to add any tables in Slack is when you actually join a channel. And then from here, you just move on to the canvas on the views section here. If you just go ahead and click on that, you will be able to add a table in the canvas and the canvas alone. You cannot really make it or have it in the messages section, unfortunately. So to create one in the canvas, it's also very, very simple. You just want to, to go ahead and open up your canvas. If you don't have one, just create one. It is uh, very easy to do. And then uh, you want to give it a name. So we can just go ahead and give it the name table. And then from here, you can just go ahead and add whichever element that you want. You can just go ahead and start writing. Or you can just go down to the bottom here, bottom right. And you can just insert a table, uh, which will create the table for us. And here we can add some columns as many as we actually want it does not really matter and we can also add more rows if you want and you can obviously go ahead and start adding some uh text in here and so on and also this is one way of doing it uh and if you want to create it in a different way you can also do so by doing slash which is going to open up the commands list for us in slack and we can just go ahead and type in table. And again, we can just go ahead and create another one. So now that we have this table and the canvas, we can do many things with it. But unfortunately, there's no way to move this to the messages section or just copy and paste or anything really. I just tried a lot of stuff here and nothing worked for me. So for the time being, this is what we have to work with, which is within the canvas itself. But as in for the messages, no uh, shot for you to add a table. With that being said, hopefully you found this video to be helpful. And thanks for watching.